Asian stocks were mixed after the Bank of Japan announced a new monetary expansion campaign. Tokyo's Nikkei gained more than 2 percent. South Korea's Kospi lost more than 1 percent, while Hong Kong's Hang Seng was closed. The U.S. economy appears to have hit a soft patch. New reports that jobs numbers fell short of expectations sent investors running on Wall Street. The Dow plunged 111 points, its worst day in more than a month. The Nasdaq fell 36 points. A big announcement from Facebook, the social network is expected to introduce a moderately priced smartphone today. Of course, it will encourage users to use Facebook. Analysts expect the ads on the new phone to help the company bring in nearly $1 billion a year. The secret of Apple's long-rumored TV may have been uncovered. Tech analyst Brian White says he pieced together information after visiting some companies in Asia. He claims the ITV will have a 60-inch screen and be controlled by an eye ring instead of a remote. White says it will cost around $2,000 and be on sale at the end of the year. And overdraft fees are back. According to a new study, credit unions charge an average of $27 per overdraft, while banks charge $30. Last year, overdraft revenue shot up just over 1% to $32 billion. That's your Money Watch. For more, stay with CBSMoneyWatch.com. In New York, I'm Ashley Morrison.